and not a cloud in sight. So you may want to layer up the sunblock today because Byron, it's going to be really warm. Yeah, that shade from the clouds that we had uh, just like what, 30 minutes Gone. ago? Gone. <laughs> the sun has kind of evaporated those clouds, I guess. This is a live look from the Crest Cam once again. And yeah, it is going to be a sizzling hot one out there for today. Take it slow and easy and drink lots of water. Stay hydrated. We are looking at that hot weather to stick around through your weekend. Watch out for some gusty storms, especially late day into the evening hours. And I think the breezes will be picking up for Father's Day. But your Juneteenth forecast here in the metro at 9 o'clock in the morning, 80 degrees. At noon, add 10. We're up to 90 degrees and almost add another 10 by 3 p.m. We're up to near 100 for this afternoon. That's when we'll have the impact weather. I believe valley locations in the metro will be at or above 100 degrees. That chance of some gusty storms this afternoon into the evening. Not a great chance, about a 20% chance this evening, but still just be alert to that. That will have that chance some gusty storms. If you hear thunder, take cover and get inside. Best chances would be across the mountains and the northeast back to the west as well. And outside of the chance of storms, it's just going to be a brutally hot day. 90 in Santa Fe with 104 in Alamogordo and 105 in the TRC area. So drink lots of water. You see that we do have that threat of some severe weather in the far northeast, clipping areas around Raton and Clayton this afternoon. Tomorrow for Father's Day, we're looking at more heat across the state with limited chances of showers and storms. I think uh, most areas will be dry for Father's Day with breezes and hot temperatures. 98 in Albuquerque today, impact weather because of the heat and also for Father's Day up to 100 degrees with temperatures uh, staying hot the next several days. Maybe a cool down if we're lucky on Monday to the middle 90s, Sasha, but all these temperatures above the average high of 92 degrees. <laughs>